Good afternoon, SCM. My name is Shama. And I'm Claire, and here are your announcements for today. Computer Programming Club will meet Monday, December 6th from 2.45 to 3.45 p.m. Seymour is looking for students to be working in front of and behind the camera. If interested in volunteer hours, please speak with Mr. Marlin in room 126 ASAP. Spots are limited. There will be a brief but mandatory meeting for all members of the girls hockey team today after school in the help room. Jerseys will be handed out. This is a reminder of the more neuroscience meeting today after school in room 333. Can't wait to see you there. And now for your sports. Congratulations to all the senior boys basketball team who improved to 2-0 last night with their hard-fought 45-42 victory over Cardinal Newman. Colin Ball scored 13 points while Nathan and Shepard chipped in with 10. It was a great overall team effort. The boys continue action this weekend in the Mark Walton Invitational. Last night, your junior boys basketball team won their second game of the season against the Newman Cardinals by a final score of 61-43. to Caleb Kowalchuk came up with a number of steals, Curtis Tiki Bell had over 20 rebounds, and Isaiah Bernard shot over 90% from the free throw line. Next game is Monday at St. Mary's at 5. Thanks, STM. Hey, STM. My name is Mikkel. Today marks the day of International Day of Abolishment of Slavery. On the same day, in 1949, the General Assembly of the United Nations adopted the Convention of the Suppression of the traf uh, Trafficking in Persons and Exploitation of Prostitution and Others. In international, um, the International Day of, all, of, 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 of sorry, for the Abolishment of Slavery is observed annually to raise awareness and reinforce global efforts to combat and uh, eradicate slavery of all forms, such as child labor, trafficking, and forced labor. Because even though slavery is, legal world, is illegal worldwide, it remains an ever-present global issue. Therefore, let us use our voices for good. Let us use our voices for those who have, uh, have been silenced by making a commitment to better humanity and promoting justice for all. Thanks, STM. And I know that something has changed, never felt this way, and right here tonight. Whoa, 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 enough, stop that, stop that. I think we've heard enough from you, I'm sorry, but you just don't make the cut. You're not talented enough. What are you talking about not talented enough? I was perfect. What's wrong with you, man? You just don't make the cut. You just weren't good enough. I don't know. I don't know where we're going to find this talent for the Christmas Assembly show. Okay, wait. Maybe we can ask the STM students. Arthur, that's not a bad idea. You heard it here first, STM. We are hosting Christmas Assembly tryouts Monday, December 12th, right after school. You get a one-minute audition for a two-minute tryout. So come bring your A-game, whether you can sing, dance, both, juggle, any talent you have. Must be school appropriate. Come on down, try out. We'll get you in front of people doing your thing. Thanks, I see you. Have a nice day. It's the thirst, thirstiest time of the year. Hey. Yeah. I had just one query. Good afternoon, STM. Monday is the absolute last day of the OSSLT. On Monday, grade 11 students who need to write or rewrite the test will be writing. You need to report immediately to the library first thing in the morning. You should have all received a personalized email from me if you are writing the test. If you have any questions, you need to see us as soon as possible today. Also, if you were absent, there were a few of you absent today that were in grade 12, and any of you who were absent for various reasons throughout this week and needed to write, Monday will be your last chance to write the literacy test. Remember, this is a graduation requirement. So if you missed the literacy test, or if you are in grade 11 and need to write the literacy test, please come to the library first thing Monday morning. The time is now 1.37 for the rest of you. Have a great day and a great weekend.